Yo, what's up everybody? Welcome back to my channel. And today's video, I have another outfit tutorial for you guys. This one's going to be different. Uh, it's going to be more old school. It's going to be a World War II outfit tutorial. So this is one outfit right here. This one I called is a World War II veteran outfit. So first, what you guys want to do is go over to tops, go to suit jackets, and get the black double breasted. Then when you're done with that, go to shirts. You'll want to get the blue tucked. Go to chinos, go in the number 43, and get the navy straight chinos. And for the shoes, it's simple. Just go to smart shoes and get the black, all black Oxfords. Go to berets and get the red garrison beret. And there you have the first outfit done for. So the next outfit that I have in line for y'all is my World War II Royal Palette. So this is a British pilot. You guys could use this outfit for like Dunkirk roleplay or European theater roleplay. Now uh, to make this outfit, it is going to be serious but simple. Sorry, not serious but simple. Uh, it will be simple for the people who have uh, Kasakas. If you have this submarine that I'm on right now, then the rest of the glitch will be simple. And yes, this is this is a glitch outfit. These pants, you guys probably recognize these joggers. These pants you can't buy in a regular store in game. You have to go in your in your Kasaka. So first, uh, since I'm already out here, I'm gonna equip the outfit that have the same joggers on. You're gonna go. You wanna go to the one that has Warlord, and you see it has the same boots and joggers. Now we can go inside, and hopefully my impressor doesn't fall in the water. Now you guys don't have to do the thing at the store where you have to like have the blue jobs on the map. That one, uh, you can do that, but it takes longer. But this method, uh, I found from another video that I'll link down in the description. So what you want to do here is go up to the scuba gear, either up here or down where uh, the moon pool vehicles are. So press right on the D-pad, you have on the scuba suit. Then retire from being a CEO. And there you go. I know it showed that I had on the royal pilot outfit, but that's not uh, what's supposed to happen. You're supposed to have the warlord outfit after that. So. And I'm gonna like um, over save it too. So, what you guys wanna do now is the famous telescope glitch okay everyone should know what the telescope glitch is by now okay so you're just gonna run up to it and you're not supposed to look into the telescope you're supposed to it won't be as easy like how mine was right there but it'll take a couple of tries before you have to get it right so your player isn't supposed to look through the telescope you're supposed to just um, not not look through it just stand still so I'm gonna go hats and I'm gonna put on the ear defenders the black ear defenders and then simply just walk away and there outfits finished all I gotta do is oh wow it, it looks so good in this light I'm not gonna lie it actually looks it actually looks really really good in this light alright guys so this next outfit right here I experimented with just a couple hours ago literally just a couple hours ago this is my pacific pilot outfit okay this one i got from a, uh, a picture i got off of, off of google and i like i really like how it looked and as you can see i even did the uh tube glitch all right this one is simple just like the last one i showed y'all so since i'm already by my wardrobe i can just show y'all where to go to like put on the clothing you will want to go to shirts again and get the lemon tucked you want to go to cargo pants and get the hawthorne cargo pants for the shoes go to boots and get the black scruff 
scruffy boots and these the reason why i chose these boots and i like these boots is because it looks more dirty so like it shows that you've been like working you've been working on an aircraft carrier trying to like repair planes and maybe you crash landed in an island in the pacific and you find and you find the japanese and like you're all in dirt and stuff fighting on an island and for accessories it's simple go to gloves and get the sand tactical because it matches with the hat and the shirt all yellow and for the watch i chose the silver let me zoom in the silver pendulous time star now for those of you guys that don't know how to do the tube glitch uh i don't know if you can go to any other location but in videos it shows you it shows you have to go here enjoy yourself uh you have to go to the vanilla unicorn in this game and just go up against this door don't go fully in but just wait just go in enough for the tube to disappear then go to the outfit and then walk out and don't worry when you go back on a on your personal vehicle or any vehicle the tube won't disappear just hurry up and save it to, to the nearest clothing store and i recommend just going to this one right here because it's just right across the street So the next outfit I have for you guys right here, a regular uh, cadet. So uh, how you make th how you make this is go to Tux uh, Server Shirts and get the beige short uniform uh, open. And for the pants, you already know it. Uh, go to chinos, oops, and get the beige straight chinos. And for the hat, same as before. The same category go to berets and get the beige garrison cap and if you guys don't want to put this on you could just put on this let me know if you need a hand okay go to military caps and you guys can put on this one the light brown peat cap let me show you how that one looks so you guys can put on that one if you want and for the watch I chose the silver Medici uh, radio. Alright guys, now for this one, this one I've been messing around with so, so much. Alright, this one right here is my World War II US soldier outfit. And as you guys can see, I got the green pouches. Uh, this one obviously is glitched. Luckily, the, uh, the job that you guys need to get these pouches, it's not patched, luckily. So, go to the front counter at any clothing store, any clothing store. Go to the bottom where it says Caprico Heist. It'll be Grassland Armor. And purchase the Naturalist. I already have all these pouches. That's why it's checkmarked. So, get the Naturalist. And you're going to want to save that where it is. And then, go to the top where it says Heist Coveralls. And get any one of these four right here. As long as it has a gas mask, it doesn't matter which uh, okay, which ahead. color of the body. I just chose this one just because it's all black. So it, again, it doesn't matter which one you guys pick. All right, guys. So we're doing we're gonna perform the telescope glitch again. And with the telescope, it doesn't matter. Okay, it doesn't matter if you go to the beach. It doesn't matter if you go to any of your uh, apartments or agency or businesses. As long as if there's a telescope and you can perform the telescope glitch, it doesn't matter. I just chose to uh, come out here is because where I need to go next is uh, not inside any of my businesses. So, I already saved the outfit. What you're going to do is perform the telescope glitch. That's my second time doing that in a row. And then go to your saved outfit. And then just walk away. And then I'd recommend going to any gun store uh, nearby and just save the outfit one more time in the same slot. In usual videos that uh, say to do this, you have to set this right here to last location. You don't really have to do that. I did it, my I did it myself to get the pouches uh, before and you don't really have to change it to last location. Hot, hot, hot. 
Honey. Look at that. We spawned with our presser right there and right in front of the gun store. So what you guys can do now, and don't worry about getting on your vehicle, the pouches will disappear. Okay. Go to any nearby clothing store and customize the outfit. And now you can save the outfit now. And now it's yours. This outfit right here is another crazy outfit that I made recently. And it's a British soldier outfit. This is like a British soldier that's like fighting in in France. And a lot of them did have uh, uniforms like this. There is a there is still a World War II film on Netflix called The Forgotten Battle. And this is where I got the concept from. I tried my best to like look at that and try to make it in game. So just go to World Order again and just do the glitch again. And I'll see you guys when I get to my wardrobe. Alright guys, now this is another pilot outfit I made. This is just a, a German pilot outfit. And to make this, it, it, to make this is also simple. First, I'm gonna show you guys how to like put on the clothing. And the clothing, the clothing part is really simple. And there you guys go. You have your German pilot. Okay guys, now this outfit right here, this one, I have been struggling with. I've been trying to make a good uh, Russian Soviet uh, Soviet sniper outfit and I finally made a pretty a pretty decent one right here. There you guys have it, your your very own Russian slash Soviet sniper. Now this one right here is a uh, Nazi soldier or just um yeah just a just a regular German soldier from World War II and they didn't from the pictures I've seen on Google and videos they didn't really wear a lot of masks. Uh, this concept right here is from Call of Duty Vanguard. How they made them in that game, uh, I actually like the concept. They made them with like the same type of clothing and stuff that they had back in the war. 
but like they gave him like masks and, and stuff and i kind of i kind of like that like I, I thought that kind of went hard so i'm gonna show you how to make this real quick Now you can save it, German soldier. And don't worry, uh, the mask won't like come off since it's compatible. Since it's compatible with this. Now this though, as you guys can see, I do have another neck gator mask right here, and this one's like a German uh, d desert trooper fighting in North Africa, and this concept is again from Call of Duty Vanguard. Now guys, uh, with the pants, I think I've shown you guys enough, just go in your Kasaka and do that glitch with the Warlord outfit to get the pants, and then just save that. But first I'm going to show you guys how you can get the mask. Down the casino, this, this negator mask right here. You will need a bike and a car. Alright, now what you guys have a car and a bike, you're going to want to go back to the counter and just like how we did before for the regular German outfit, you're going to want to go to biker helmets and get any any biker helmet from down here to basically the, the, very, the very bottom of the list. These, these biker helmets right here will not work you see like the mask came off so I'm just gonna put this regular one right here and I'm gonna save that desert trooper and then after you save it come pick any hat that you want okay I'm gonna this is the one I had on when I saved it so I'm gonna put this one on so make sure you have your saved offer ready as soon as you go into your car and it doesn't matter any any vehicle okay it doesn't uh, just, just as long as it's not a bike just make sure you have like an actual car actual vehicle as soon as you go in uh, you, you're gonna try to spam X and to uh, put on your saved outfit then get on your get on your bike and this part you're gonna have to try to time it right and there you go Anyway guys, I know that I didn't uh, show like where to get the top, this top, so just go to leather jackets and get the brown leather field jacket, it'll be in like the 40s for y'all. And then obviously for the gloves, you got the black, you got the black fingerless gloves. This offer right here is a SS officer outfit, in case any of y'all wanted to like, if y'all were to role play and like make a video. And this is also made from Call of Duty Vanguard, from that uh, that one dude with the the hairline like a like a tight corner. It's kind of kind of it wasn't Hitler, but uh, he was a I think I think it was a general. So go to biker jackets and go to 53 and get the black classic biker. Get the tan okay, cuff shirt. There you go. Same as you same uh, as before. On my German soldier outfit, you go to utility pants and get the one at the very bottom of the list, the black heist pants. And then with the boots, shouldn't be trouble for you guys, like I said, black flight boots. And then for the gloves, get the black leather gloves, should be at the bottom of the list, it's near the bottom of the list for me. And then with the hats, you want to go to berets again and get the black garrison gap. 
uh, cap beret. And then we are done. Save the outfit. Now this one isn't really uh, World War Two, but I thought I'd just throw it in here because it's kind of it's kind of military, and they did have uniforms like this back then. So uh, I thought I'd just throw it in. But just know, if you want to get the Captain outfit, you'll sadly have to get the Galaxy Super Yacht. That's how that's how I got this. I did I got the Super Yacht, and I did all the missions, and I unlocked it for roleplay. Actually, hold up. The hat will be part of the outfit. So. Let me just show y'all what I added. I forgot about that. With the pants, it's in chinos. Go to number 45 and get the white straight chinos. And then for the shoes, get the all black Oxfords. Jeez, I'm making bank in my businesses. All right. And then with the watches, I chose this white gold watch, but with the watch, you get to choose whatever watch you want. I recommend getting the charcoal cop frames. And you guys have your captain outfit. Alright everyone, that's it for this video. If you did enjoy, please do like, comment, subscribe. And let me know down below if you guys actually enjoyed the outfits that I showed y'all. And let me know if you guys would like to see me make another outfit tutorial video like this. I really enjoyed the outfits that I made and the outfits I showed y'all. And hopefully you guys did like it. Comment down below if you you want to see me make another alpha tutorial video, whether it's like Marvel, DC, or or military. And I'll see you on the next one. Are you